Hey everybody, before I begin, uh, I'd like to start off a uh, little uh, farm safety PSA. I'm in my kitchen at, at night, uh, just got out of the shower. Uh, it's about midnight, um, just got down out of the field for the night. So in this video, um, we we'll kind of cover a breakdown we had. I did not get the best coverage of it uh, just because of what was going on with it. Uh, just trying to stay safe and uh, kind of keep everyone level-headed. I know uh, when, when stuff that can be stressful when that stuff happens. Um, was no one's fault, uh, just years of, um, I, wanna, I don't want I don't want to say neglect, but just years of wear on, on equipment, just stuff happens. You can't, can't always prevent everything. Work with your family and, and your workers to stay safe this harvest season. And just take, take your time, everybody. Take this harvest like it could be your last and, and just go one more round. Just keep on going. Hope you enjoy the video. If you stick around till the end of the video, I'll kind of explain what I had going on. I didn't get exactly great coverage just because it was kind of stressful. And we've we've never really dealt with a breakdown and and me trying to to farm farm YouTube on the side. So uh, bear with me. I'll explain that at the end of the video. Enjoy. Going through, going through the combine. Gonna switch over to corn here. Uh, that stuff's probably farther along and easier to dry at this point than the beans. Just wait for them to mature. So we're we're doing some switch over here. Gonna go try around across to, across the waterway from home. So I'm right here with. Uh, I don't think I featured. Uh, this is my grandma and grandpa Wagner. Uh, grandpa Wagner, uh, first generation farmer. Um, and grandma, they've been married for how long? Sixty-nine years in November. Sixty-nine years in November. They're both. Uh, they're Grandpa's 91, Grandma will be 91 in November. Um, do you guys have any uh, any advice or any any words of wisdom for us starting off in, in the harvest here, in corn harvest, bean harvest? Yeah, just be careful and take your time so you don't get hurt. <laughs> no, that's a good idea. It's a good idea? Yeah, it's a good idea. Haste kind of makes waste at times. Sometimes just make sure you're doing terrible all the time. Beautiful crop out there, and want to enjoy it because it's, uh, it's the last time too. <laughs> That's right. That's right. Let me get rolling here, Sunny. Sunny. the most important piece on. All right, Garrett, we got the globe back on. Yep, now we're smart again. Here we go on corn. Uh, they'll take it at the elevator. It's easier to dry right now, so that's what we're gonna do. I'll go hop in the cart. We're getting ready to roll here. It's awful green, but the corn itself is ready to go just by moisture, and it looks like it's gonna be good corn.
how's it looking from the, the combine there? Um, pretty good. I think a lot of it is down around 20%, so we're good enough to put the bin and maybe get our dryer going. So um, the yield seems solid, I guess. So we'll see. We don't have anything calibrated yet, so hard to say. But yeah, we're happy with the moisture so far. Definitely the greenest corn I think we've ever harvested. Hard to believe it's actually that dry when it's plants that green. And it's September 26th today, so we're doing corn. About unheard of. Kind of hard on the, the head. I keep plugging one room because it's so yeah, green. Yeah, I, I see that. Did you weld a, a nut on it or something? Never have a nut. Okay. I could drill a hole. What I would do first here. A little bit of a big Wagner breakdown here. Takes us all to get a break. That was bound to happen before too long, so no one's fault. A little production here, a little. How's that, Gary? That's great. Really ought to start our own repair shop, huh, Dad? Yep. We're back in business for like another hour oh, or two. So how we're set up here is this trucks will ride, trucks will run and dump one over there and it'll go up into our wet hold bin and then this auger is going to go up and into our dryer. About a thousand cranks later, we're good. We're gonna just gotta get it over the hole there. Well, that'll wrap it up for today. Didn't get a lot of crop out, but we uh, we did something a little fun with breakdown. I hope you hope you all enjoy that. We sure didn't. Terrific start to harvest. Uh, we're gonna gonna roll home on corn here across the waterway, across from where we would bale this past summer. Thanks for hanging out, everybody. Take care. We'll leave this sleeping little pigs. Gotta have the pigs in the video somehow. Good night, pigs. All right, guys, if you made this far, basically what happened was um, we were putting the auger up to the wet bin. Uh, this is the auger that we have a hopper on that has a dr we drive over a, a drive over that conveyors it up into this hopper and up to the wet bin, which then gets held before it goes to our dryer. Um, so what had happened, we were moving the hopper on that auger and the cord snapped for, it's a it's a crank as you saw there, the cord snapped on there and we it fell down on the auger, made a big big dent as you saw there. So we tried uh, one of those, it's a pull hammer, push hammer, uh, probably pull hammer, make more sense. Um, and so we tried that, didn't work, and then we ended up just cutting uh, cutting it off and then uh, putting it back on, welding it back on, straightened it out, and then welded it back on. So, gave it a rattle can paint job, uh, but no, it's we're back up and running. Um, we've got it actually moved over to, uh, over by the shop on a bin for beans. 
Um, we're, we're plugging along on beans right now. We've been getting some rain, it's kind of wet. Um, moisture's been, been all kind of all over the board. The beans themselves are more than ready, the stems are not so much, but uh, when you know, we get some of this moisture back, uh, moisture's been a lot more favorable and the yields are terrific. We're very pleased with what we're seeing so far. Um, look forward to getting a lot of crop out this year. Hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks everybody.